What's going on everybody? So I have these spindles here. I bought them from someone on the East Coast and as you can see pretty caked with rust. Um, I saw a couple of videos on YouTube talking about using the, this stuff here. Your Bapo rust. And I see pretty, some pretty good results with it. So I'm going to go ahead and stick these in this bucket. I'm actually going to leave them in there for a few days and then uh, we'll see how that goes. So I didn't really buy enough of the evaporust but uh, I have one fully submerged in there and then one of the pieces for the ball joint down there. So once uh, the bottom one's done I'll just go ahead and dunk the top one in and then we'll see if it works. Alright so I've had them sitting in here for maybe 12 hours maybe a little bit longer as you can see the, the fluids a lot darker and that uh, ball joints pretty clean but uh, I've been moving them around and just kind of agitating the fluid I'm gonna leave them in there another couple of days and we'll see how they look alright so I've had them in there for a full three days and they're looking pretty good uh, as you can see a lot of the rust was taken off of this one this one was actually fully submerged this one wasn't I didn't get enough in the bucket but uh, as you can see that was the part that was sticking out still but it did a lot of good work it uh, removed a bunch of it let me show you the other side so even that side's a lot cleaner but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get a fresh batch of the stuff and dump them in there again it actually I hear a lot of people say that you should stop using them using the, the liquid once it turns black and that's pretty black there so yeah I'm gonna get a fresh batch of it and then I'll dunk them back in there for uh, another few days and see if we can get everything off of there got some more of this stuff in and uh, I got rid of the old stuff so I'm just gonna pour it back in and let it sit in there for a few more days and we'll see how everything comes out as you can see it's more of like a orange brown liquid when it starts out but uh, once it eats away all the rust, it turns it all black, so... We'll see how this second batch turns out. Alright guys, so... Pulled them out of the last uh, dip. As you can see, they're super clean now. All the rust is gone. Um, everything is super clean. So I'll just hit them with the coat of paint just so they don't rust over again. But it's not big that's not much of a problem here in Southern California. But eventually I'll get these modified to make them into drop spindles for my truck. But uh yeah. Really recommend that evaporus stuff. Work really well. As you can see at the beginning of this video, these were horribly covered in rust. And now they're super clean and ready to be used again. So yeah, thanks for watching guys.